Crisis at the consulate. Spanish services halted. Israel strikes back at Spain's moves. Embassy eviction looms. Will Spain be forced out? Israel's foreign minister Israel Katz has announced that the Spanish consulate in Jerusalem will no longer provide services to the Palestinians from the West Bank. This decision follows Spain's announcement of recognizing an independent Palestinian state. Katz stated in a statement, I have decided to severe the connection between Spanish mission to Israel and Palestinians and to prohibit the Spanish consulate in Jerusalem to provide any sort of service to Palestinians from the West Bank. This action was in response to Spain's minister's controversial remark which Israel didn't like. Reportedly, Yolanda Diaz stated that from the river to the sea, Palestine will be free, a phrase which is viewed by many as anti-Semitic, implying the eradication of Israel as a Jewish state. Katz suggested that Diaz must learn the 700 years of Islamic rule in Spain to understand the radical Islam. Since October 7 Hamas attack and the ongoing Gaza war, tensions have risen. Several Spanish lawmakers have faced criticism for anti-Israel and anti-Semitic remarks. This development also comes as a response to Spain's action including the denial of docking of an Israel-bound ship from India and criticism of Israeli actions in Gaza, particularly in Rafah. Israel has vehemently responded to Spain's constant subversion. Before this, Spain has often been critical of Israel. Spain's Youth and Children Minister Cyril Rego on October 16, after the Hamas attack, stated that Palestine had the right to resist after decades of occupation and called the entire Israeli diplomatic delegation to be expelled from Spain. Since then, the tensions between the two nations have been at severe odds, but in recent days, the tensions and hostilities have escalated to unprecedented levels. Jerusalem responded angrily to the announcement recalling the ambassador from the country for immediate consultations. The foreign ministry had summoned the country's envoys in Israel to view a video of the capture of female Israel Defense Force soldiers by Hamas on October 7. This action was in part of Israel's response to the recognition of Palestinian state by Spain, Ireland and Norway.